Hi guys, this is Sevi Sylvester. I'm a CAD CAM trainer and mechanical designer in Setpoint for Tech Private Limited. So today I'm going to give you a basic introduction about AutoCAD. AutoCAD is a software from a company called Autodesk. It is an American company. It was released in 1982. It is marketed and sold by IBM. So before starting and giving you the basic introduction about AutoCAD, AutoCAD everybody knows what is AutoCAD. It is a 2D and 3D software, including isometric views and all. So I am going to give you something different to how to animate and how to rotate object in this thing. We all know that how we can simulate the things in SolidWorks. We can simulate the things in uh, CAD and all. But today I am going to tell you how to uh, rotate a thing. How to Put a script on AutoCAD. So we have just now we are working with uh, 2012. This is a software. So before starting this, I want to give a basic introduction about my company also, whom I am working with. I am working with a company called Setpa Infotech Private Limited. We are situated in Lucknow. We are situated in uh, Noida. We are situated in Rurki. We are situated. In, we are also there in uh, Chandigarh also. So before starting this, my, what my company main is company is Computer Education uh, Technology Promotion Association. So, so here we are. This is a workbench of 2012. Here, how to open a new file? Go to File and New File. Open ACAD, just double enter on this. So this is our workbench of 2012. This is all our grids. This is our origin UCS. The black screen is called GUI. Graphical user interface. This is our uh, 3D portion, how to rotate this thing and all. This is a 3D compass. This is known as, uh, this toolbox is known as tool drawing toolbar. This toolbar is known as uh, modify toolbar. This is a layer toolbar. This is the uh, toolbar of property toolbar from where we can change our various type of workbenches all. This is a type of uh, line weight and all. We can put change the color of the line and all. We can change the color of line weight and all. So basically F7 is for grids on and off. See if I am pressing F7, you can see it here. If you are pressing F7, so it is enable and disable it. Suppose what we are going to do, we are going to write a script. Suppose we are having a circle and we want to rotate the circle about something. Suppose we are having a circle, C enter and starting point is 0, 0. And the diameter of the circle, C, specify the radius of the circle. You can see it here. Specify the radius of the circle. The radius of the circle is suppose 50. So this is 50. And you can change the color by this thing. Suppose this is red and you can change the color line weight also. Suppose we are going to create. 0.53 and you can create like this one suppose we are having one more circle here just on the very very of this thing you can change the color of this you change in the color so that we can recognize the thing what is rotating and what is still fixed so basic thing is this how to rotate this thing about this thing to follow a path we are following this path so before writing a script, we have to make a group. Suppose this is a group. How to make a group? Just type G enter. Select a group or N or D. Means select a name or describe. Select a group means we have to write a name and enter. Group name is suppose 1 and the object selection is this thing. We are going to make a group. So this is now a group. How to write a script? Notepad and double enter. So a one notepad file will be opened on your screen board. How to write a script? Just write rotate R O T A T E. Okay. Type G. G is group. Which group? What we have created? Group number one. Enter and enter. Here we are going to take take two enters. Then after what? About what axis you want to rotate this? Suppose the center point is zero comma zero. So zero comma zero we have written and the angle suppose we want to rotate in one second we want to rotate it in one minus five angle if you want to take it in clockwise then we are going to take the value in minus and if you want to take it in uh, anti-clockwise so there, there we are going to take it in positive values enter delay delay is thousand one second is equal to thousand d e l a y one uh, second is equal to thousand suppose we are going to take it uh, 200 enter then we are going to write our script c r i p t enter and double enter and you are going to save it save it like suppose 11 
yeah you can write uh, script okay you can write dot scr the file should be saved in scr suppose we are going to save it on our desktop this is the script we are going to save it here you can see we have saved the script and all now how to apply that thing in here just type scr enter and where is the script script and enter so this portion is going to rotate continuously in 360 degree see so this type of things you can do on autocad think so you like this things and all hope so you enjoyed meet you in my next tutorial thank you